And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Well, cool and cloudy, a bit breezy out there, and even a few light sprinkles at this time. Not necessarily uh, what we'd like to see, considering we've dealt with some pretty warm temperatures over the last few days. But you know what? Considering, we'll take it, 46 degrees was your high temperature. It's still a couple degrees above average. Unfortunately, we're not going to be seeing temperatures quite like that for at least the next four or five days. Right now, 36 degrees, 10 degrees shy of where we were earlier on this afternoon. Wind still breezy, sustained around 12 miles per hour, gusting up near 20, 25 miles per hour, keeping things a little bit cooler. Not cool as what Remington shows right now, 6 degrees. More like 36 degrees throughout much of the region. Remington reading a little off this evening. 37 in Frankfurt, 37 in Crawfordsville as well at this hour. Now pulling out throughout the entire Midwest, we're not alone in this cold weather. 35 Davenport, a little bit off to the east of us, a little bit warmer. 40 degrees right now in Columbus. Heck, still holding on to 49 degrees in Pittsburgh at this hour. So all that cold weather, though? Headed towards the east coast, so don't get too jealous of the folks in Pittsburgh at this hour. Notice the cool conditions over the last 24 hours. These temperatures dropping. We're 14 degrees cooler right now than we were 24 hours ago. But off to our west, things looking a little bit better. Actually, a little bit of uh, not quite a warm-up necessarily, but one degree warmer in Davenport uh, than it was just about 24 hours ago. So some light at the end of the tunnel as far as the cooling goes. And notice the precipitation as well. A couple light sprinkles out there. Not falling as snow, but a little bit blue on your precision uh, tracker radar. It's all thanks to the same low pressure system that we've been talking about so much over the last couple of days. Now spinning east, pushing out of parts of Wisconsin over Lake Michigan. And that will continue to roll eastward, bringing cooler conditions back to greater Lafayette. After reaching temperatures near 60 degrees yesterday, Afternoon highs tomorrow only peaking around the upper 30s, low 40s. Now, at least again, overnight tonight we stay primarily dry. The mostly cloudy skies do stick around, and that helps to keep temperatures relatively stable, not falling much further overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning. We bottom out around 33 degrees in West Lafayette early tomorrow. Your bus stop forecast tomorrow morning, not a warm one, 34 by 8 a.m., 35 by 9 at least the day tomorrow should be a dry one, but higher pressure pushing in from the west, unfortunately, will not clear the skies across Greater Lafayette. What it will do, supplies with more of a west-northwesterly wind flow, keeping temperatures lower. We have cloud cover, we got northerly winds, and temperatures as a result only reach the 40-degree mark both Thursday and Friday. We even cool off to 39 on Saturday. Don't get too scared about that wintry mixture on Sunday. That's going to be an interesting situation. We've got a wave of moisture moving in early Sunday morning. It'll start off as light snowfall. Don't expect accumulation because right around 9, 10 o'clock in the morning on, set, or on Sunday, rather, we will see that turn over into a rain. And then the good news is all that snow, if it does accumulate at all, will melt. Some interesting situ situations later in the week, though. We had a high temperature 61 next Wednesday. Thursday, guess what the high is? 27. <laughs> Big drop in temperature there. I can't so, keep up. No, no <laughs> one can at this point. You know, it's the beginning of December, and uh, it's going to be a little bit rough going ahead, but uh, the good news is a couple dry days ahead of us. All right. Thanks, Cameron. Yeah.